All right, so this is how you replace the touch screen on a 3DS. First things first, you're going to need this screwdriver piece. Zero, zero is what it's called on the iFixit toolkit. Do not do that. Do as I say, not as I do, you know. Remove these four screws. Boom, take off the back, take out the battery. Then remove the 10 screws that are on the back here. That's four. That's nine. And the one on top here. Boom. Now, lift this cover up, remove that, boom, remove that, put that aside, take out the SD card if you haven't already, remove the this part, the joystick, two long screws there, boom, and I'll remove these two yellow screws for the SD card, you know what, let me zoom in for the SD card holder. Two, lift that up. Yeah, there's some adhesive under here, which is holding it to the metal plate. I like to just put in my toolkit to, or my screwdriver piece to hold it, and then lift it up with my finger. Now, take out this part, boom. The joystick put that aside lift this up now lift that up take out that cable and push it back down lift that up take out the cable and push it back down remove this tape piece boom lift that up take it out and push it back down now take out this Wi-Fi thing, remove the microphone, boom. Oops, now take out the four screws. One, two, three, four. And did I say two screws or four screws? Then gently lift this up. There are some double-sided tape under this uh, charging port and make sure you don't ruin these cables. So be really careful when lifting this up. Really careful. And this, okay. And I'm stupid. Then remove these two screws here, one screw there. And then yeah, you need to lift up this metal plate to get to the second one. Boom. And then remove this metal plate. Boom. Now you can gently lift up the motherboard. There are some. There is some double-sided tape under this uh, charging port, so be really careful with that. And make sure to not rip the cables that are on the other side. So be on the lift up this area and once it's up you can just flip it like a book boom make sure that the wi-fi cable is in place boom and now you can take out the screen then put your nail under here and lift that up and off now you can put on your new screen boom and put this in place there we go put that down it already has a scratch for some reason then put this back in boom boom take out the wi-fi and put it back down Make sure everything is correctly, and then 
take out the cables, which are which you're going to need. Boom. Take that one out too. There we go. Make sure everything is down, which it wasn't because of the Wi-Fi cable. Put in the Wi-Fi chip back into place. Come on. Boom. Microphone down. Then you can put this piece back on here. Push this down. And then put in these cables back in. Boom, and close it up. Lift it up again. Push the cable in. Once it's in all the way, close it up again. Now for the last one, I'm actually going to use some tweezers, pliers, whatever they were called. Boom to get that into place. Come on. Oh, come on. Yeah, that one is a little challenging. Boom, and close it up. Make sure that's in place. Oh, you know what? No, let's lift that up. And insert the two black screws that are supposed to be in here. Boom. One screw. Come on. And two. They might not be black for you. Like for the other 3DS that I fixed today, they were white, I think. Now, put that down. Put this down. And these two yellow screws, put them through the hole here. Boom, screw them in. Boom. Now I'll actually remove this part because it just makes reinstalling harder and it's pretty unnecessary. Make sure this is in place. Come on. Boom, and then close, put that back in, reinsert these two long screws that are holding it in place, boom, oh yeah I forgot to do something, which is to make sure that this is, oh come on, please focus, there we go, that this is on the bottom, so I'm going to gently lift the motherboard up, Take that down and push it back down. So this works, you can see. Boom. Pretty useless function. I think it just turns off the internet. But you can also just do that in the settings. So, But yeah, still better to have it than to not have it. Put in these four screws. Boom. Then close it up again that in come on come on put that in close up and put in all of the 10 screws back in starting with the black one and why does the camera not focus there we go Boom. 
Um, boom. Put in the battery. Reinsert the SD card. Boom. Put the cover on. Put in the four screws. And voila, you're done. Almost. Turn that on. Make sure that everything works. Ugh. Yep, it does. Great. Now, cover this off again. You're going to take off the this part, this plastic piece. Please focus. Please focus. Please focus. Please focus. iPhone 15. Please focus. Please focus. There we go. Nope. Take this off the touch screen. Come on. Come on. That can be a little hard to deal with. Boom. Boom. Make sure this adhesive is on correctly and not in the way. Boom. Nope, still in the way. There we go. And then, you know what? Oh, that is the One X camera. There we go. Put in one corner, bend it a little to put it, nope, to put it into the second corner and the third, then the third, then the third corner and then the last corner. Just bend it down and boom, it's in place. There we go. It's working, tested, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Like, just like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.